one shirt out of my uh, tracker today. You've been a good girl. So just finished up. Uh, we're going to move the cows. We're going to feed. And we had two new babies. A heifer. Baldy heifer. And then uh, big mama. Number 18. Who has had mastitis in the past. We treated it. Her udder is. And uh, she had a bull calf. So that's two more on our list today so excited so excited so once i get through the gate um we'll go back up there and uh, get that little baldy heifer and get it to its mama um, big mama's bringing her baby down the line so big mama's got her baby with her right there and jason's got that heifer on the other side but i'm trying to figure out who its mama is first-time mamas is they kind of can't quite figure out what they're supposed to do. There's a lot going on. Um, if you ever had a baby, you kind of get the idea. But uh, sometimes they just freak out and they don't know what to do. Or they don't realize to bring their baby with them or whatever reason. Um, yesterday we went ahead and littleized all those heifers and they're mingling very happily and nicely with the bulls. Let love begin. Um, so those heifers should calve in January. These cows, um, we're gonna pull the calves off through fall, breed cows starting in May. So that'll be a nice little, um, there'll be a nice little break between our first time heifers in January, and then we'll have our cows and second time heifers in February. In hopes to have everything calved out before April 1st. So that way in April we can worry about getting our equipment ready for hay season and everything up and going for May and our fun stuff. So Jason's just looking at that baby, which I want to really look at that baby, but it is so windy and I didn't bring my good camera because I am not prepared. Just, just how it is sometimes. Um, it's very, very windy. There are storms moving and I don't know if you guys can see. Uh, more rain to come. Just as it was starting to dry out. Pretty sure mom is this baldy right here. She's just like, gonna go. Eight just does what she wants. Runs the show. Baby, we need to find your mommy. She's right here, but so is, the baby is right here, but so is Apple and 48, and neither one of them are happy about this current situation. Look at them, look at us, like, yeah.
So the shop is getting closer. Uh, today they're going to be working on spraying um, insulation on the roof and the sides. And then we've just got to finish getting this leveled out. And then the concrete will come. So, so in between that, we're still working on the manure spreader in hopes to have it done here in a little bit so that we can go spread on the corn silage plot area field. Come on, buddy. That's where we're at. And it's supposed to be 80 today, and I've yet to see it. It's cold and windy and breezy. literally always something never fails um, went to go put out one load of manure and the floor gave out so I guess we'll hand scoop it back out and fix the back half I guess yay
See what you're at there. Keep going a little more. Oh. spreading some manure uh, we've been stockpiling it all all winter in my arena it's not an arena no more it's like a feedlot um, we had already planned to put manure out on um, our silage plot our silage field before fertilizer prices went up but now we really are dumping it to it I guess he's got it full. Just gotta learn to go around it. Praise God, 
when the weather does hit us just right. Than it does to make the two passes down 